Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in today's video we're going to be trying out a new clothing brand that I've never tried before, Joni Clothing. And they have very kindly gifted me all of these items that I'm going to be showing you guys in this video today. So thank you so much to them. I'm really excited to be trying out this brand because their clothing looks absolutely gorgeous and just sort of like right down my street because it looks a bit different, a bit unique. So yeah, I'm very excited to jump straight into this video. So let's go. All of the items that we'll be looking at from Joni Clothing today are going to be dresses. This first one is in collaboration with Laura Ashley. The item is called Nia Daniela Floral Print Lace Collar Button Down Prairie Dress. I got this in a size 22. I've included a close up of the pattern there for you guys because I'm never quite sure how well the camera picks up on the patterns. So I just wanted to make sure you could get a good look at that. The pattern is stunning, a beautiful floral pattern made up with small red, blue and white flowers. Even the collar is just a gorgeous design. I love how it has such intricate lacing. It really adds such an elegant vibe to the overall design of the dress. The pearl buttons down the front of the dress, which can be undone to help you get into the dress with more ease, are also a very luxurious addition to the dress. Speaking of luxurious, the quality of the fabric on this dress is absolutely amazing. There is two layers to it, the pattern layer and then a plain navy layer underneath. The fabric is made from pure organic cotton, which explains why it feels such amazing quality, because it's an extremely good quality fabric. Although I have to be completely honest, I am not a huge fan of the way this fits on me. It's very long lengthwise and on the arms as well, which I'm just not a huge fan of. I feel like this is due to my height as I'm only 5 foot 1. It also looks rather blocky around the shoulder area and the collar is too high for my liking. I'm just not sure if it suits me that well. The fabric doesn't have much give or stretch to it. Just thought I'd mention that if it's something you value when you're buying new clothing. Overall, the quality and the pattern of the dress is absolutely incredible. I'm just not not sure how much I like the look of this on me personally. This next dress is called Jenna Heart Print Dagger Collar Mini Dress on the Joni Clothing website. I got this in a size 24 as I needed a little bit more room to get it over my bust. Again, I've included a close-up of the incredible pattern it has on this one. I was drawn to this dress because of how colourful the heart pattern is and it's also a very unique pattern which I've never seen on any other clothing item before. I was also drawn to this one because it gave me a Wednesday Adams sort of vibe, but with a colourful twist to it as well. I prefer this one to the previous dress we looked at because the collar sits slightly lower and personally I think that suits me a lot better. Again, this dress features pearl buttons, which I think adds to the amazing quality of it and it is made from natural fibres, making it eco-friendly too, which is amazing. This dress also has a little bit more stretch to it because it has an elasticated panel at the back. I always prefer a little bit of wriggle room in my clothing. The only issue that I have with this dress is again the length. The arms are particularly long as well. I feel like this is because of a mixture of two things, my height and the fact that I had to size up with this particular dress. On the model, the dress sits just above the knees, so I feel like that just shows you how much this dress swamps me in terms of length. I definitely would have preferred it if it was a bit shorter, but the design and pattern is just so cool, plus I love that the quality is so good as well. This next dress is from the Dawn O'Porter collection and it's called Pink Lady Vintage Diner Print Dress on the Joni Clothing website. I got this in a size 22. I have included a close-up of the design centered around the bust area as I'm not sure how well the camera picked up on those small designs. It's a very cutesy pattern with mini diner food illustrations. You can see the diner pattern along the hem of the skirt quite clearly there though without a close-up. I was very drawn to it as it's a super unique retro design. It's giving very summery vibes. The buttons down the front of the bust are also workable buttons if you're wondering about that. This also features a scooped neckline, which I always think I suit a lot better than anything that has a fuller or enclosed neckline. This dress hasn't got any stretch to it or any give, but it does fit me really well. I would just make sure to go by the measurements on the website to make sure you're getting the correct size for yourself. Again, this feels extremely good quality, and that is because it is made out of natural fibres and soft cotton. I'm actually okay with the length of this one, even though it is a little on the longer side again, but the neckline and the fit and flare of it seems to make it sit better on me compared to the other dresses I've shown you guys here. I think this is my favourite dress that I've shown you so far. I already have a couple of ideas how I'm going to style it already as you may have noticed from the thumbnail. It's just a very pretty dress and suits my body shape really well as well. 
This next dress is from the Laura Ashley collection on the Joni Clothing website. I got this in a size 22. I have included a close-up of the navy blue and white floral design to show you guys because it was difficult to pick that up on camera from far away. Absolutely love the design of this dress. It's got a very simple yet elegant pattern there. The collar is given such vintage vibes, especially with the collar's scalloped hem. That is a very interesting yet cute choice of design. And I see that we're back with the pearl buttons. Such a sophisticated touch to the dress also. Again, I like that the collar sits lower on me as that look seems to suit me a lot better than the ones that sit closer to my neck. This dress has very little stretch to it again, something to know if you prefer elasticity to your clothing. This is from the Laura Ashley collection and I feel like it has the same sort of organic cotton feel to it. Very good quality fabric and similar to the first one we looked at. It has two layers, the floral pattern layer and then a plain navy layer underneath. The length of this one isn't too bad but it's still a little long for my liking. Again, that's just an issue with my short height I think. The sleeves are also a little on the longer side too but they can be easily rolled up at the arm as they are cuffed. Overall, this is such a cutesy style dress, maybe a little more formal looking as it has such simple colours, but very pretty nonetheless. So that is everything that I've got to show you guys today, I hope you enjoyed today's video, and if you did, please remember to give it a big thumbs up because it does help out my YouTube channel. If you're interested in plus size fashion, makeup or beauty, then remember to subscribe to my channel because that is everything that I do here. If you like the look of anything that I reviewed from Jodie Clothing today, I'll link everything in the description box below for you guys. And remember if you want to go and check out any of my other social medias including instagram facebook or snapchat there'll be a link to my link tree in the description box below for you guys as well if you want to check out any of those thank you so much for watching and thank you so much for supporting my youtube channel i'll see you guys in the next one bye